Are you ready? Yeah. Peter. I'm, I'm Good ready. evening, Peter. <laughs> Good evening, teacher. How are you doing tonight? I'm good. <laughs> so what did you do today? You tell me your day first. You tell me your day first. How was your day? Um, uh, talk uh, about today. Yes. Uh, I'm uh, I work I work in a company in my you work. Company. Yes, you work today. And aside mm -hmm. from working, what did you do? Like, did you eat somewhere? Like, did you eat in a restaurant? Uh, restaurant. You understand? Restaurant. Uh, yes. I uh. <laughs> I eat uh, my home. <laughs> ah, you eat in your home. Okay. It's okay. Well, anyways, as I promised, we'll have our formal lesson for us um, today. So it's uh, Unit 10. It's talk about projects. Okay? Yes. So you already have the code of the day. Like a goal without a plan is just... A wish, but today is not a wish because we have a goal for you, and that's for you to learn, right? So we have our word power, right? As of our objectives over here. So can you read? Collocations. Uh, Collocations, very good. Projects. Projects. Protest. All right. Read everything, please. Uh, Next. Possible tense. The this this cries. Discussion. Uh, uh, discussion. This. Discussions. Very good. Describe a project that you took part in. Describe the, the timeline of a project that you will talk about in. Take. A take. Take part in. All right. Take part in. So, <clears throat> all right. Here. Let's do a warm up. So, when you want to buy something important, for example, a camera, how do you decide what to buy? Do you ask? people for recommendations or read about the products in magazines or search in the internet uh, I read no this one this is a question uh, uh, it's yeah one. this is regarding to you so when you try to buy something important so this is just an example a camera Right. So, how do you decide what to buy? Did you ask um, people's recommendations, or do you read um, the products, um, like in the magazine or search in the internet? You try to explore. What exactly. do you do before? Yes. What did you do, or mean? What do you do before buying stuff or things, Peter? Uh. I uh, I see a price. You see the price, okay. Uh, what yeah. else? I see uh, the uh, I see a machine uh, configuration. The car uh, again? Uh, con 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 configuration uh, configuration 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 configuration. Yes, uh, all right, that's correct. So you don't. See, I see the configuration. That's a wrong grammar. You try to say, I try to look. Look, you look for the price. You look for the configuration. All right. You started the configuration. That's correct. Right. For example, when you try to buy a laptop or a cell phone, you 
look at the specs, right? Yeah. So the like the memories or the 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 pixels of the camera, the battery life, right? Do you you do that when you buy those uh, like when you buy phones? I am. Um, oh no, yes, I uh, I. Uh... I uh, I uh, I see uh, <laughs> I look, do not use the word see. Uh, I look, um, I look, uh, camera, battery. I, uh, you look on the cam, on the battery of the camera. What else? Screen, the springs. <laughs> screen, um, uh, Colors. The colors. All right. Okay. Well, they're like the physical of the camera. Well, yeah, that's nice though. That's a uh, um, because some people will try to look at on the model of the camera, what year it was being launched in the market, right? Because most of the people or the techy people, especially the vloggers. They always um, have this instinct that they should get the latest one, right? Right here, let's try to do, do a word power. You know this? Okay. So, all right. So, match the verb on the left, this one. So, with the noun phrases on the right. These are the nouns, and this is are the verbs. All right. So to describe some of the things you do before, okay, before buying something. So there is more than one way to match some of the verbs, right? So this is the example. Go to. Go to a store, or go to different suppliers. Now, can you answer this one next? The next one, like the telephone. Telephone, uh, a store. Mm. Uh, the phone. Uh, the phone. Um, a telephone, different supplier. Different suppliers. Yes. What else? Uh, as about. As about price. The prices. Very good. Now, what about ask about the prices? Prices. Okay. Ask for. Ask for uh, different models. Different models. Very good. Uh, look at. Um, look at recommendations. Look at recommendations. That's correct. Yeah. Two. Choose uh, the best model. Choose the best model. Very good. Make a, a decision. Decision. Very good. Nice. Nice. Very good. So, how do you form the past simple tense? I mean, the past simple of these verbs. So, you tell me. All right. Or you type. Okay. Over here. I want you to. I want you to type in here. Type in your answer. Okay? Here. Okay? Oh. All right. <clears throat> mm -hmm. So this one, this first word. Arrived. Arrived. Arrive. So make this one a simple tense. Arrive it. Arrive. Arrive it. Correct.
mid 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 that is correct regular very good in it span stand it finished very good <coughs> Spend. Spend. Oh, yes. Oh, spend it. Mm -hmm. All right. That's wrong. Okay, let's proceed over here. I will tell you the answer later. Here. Decide it. Very good. Very good. So you only have one wrong. This one. You know the meaning of the word spend? Spawn. Spend. Spend and then spawn. No. You know the meaning of spend? Like, um, you buy something yesterday. Your wife will ask you, where did you spend the money? Right? But this one, the past tense, the past tense, or the past simple of this verb is spent. Spent. Spent, like this. I'll show you. This one. Would be. <laughs> okay, that is an irregular verb, okay? <laughs> okay. Anyways, aside from that, you're doing a good job, okay? Very good. Mm -hmm. Now this one. So think of something you bought a short time ago or a while ago. So where did you buy it and how did you choose it? So make a list of things you did before you bought it. You understand this one? Read. Read this one. Read. Read. Think. Go. Where did you buy it? Then uh, talk about uh, talk about uh, yeah. laptop. Laptop. You bought a laptop. When did you buy? When did you bought the laptop? Uh, I I do I do to buy a, a laptop at a store. At a store. Store. When when did you bought that? Uh, last month. Last month. All right. Say month. Uh, month. Month. No, month. Month. No, month. Month. All right, very good. Last month. Last month. No, not last month. It's last month. I see, um, Trey. I, I, uh, I, uh, I see Trey Mac. Trey mm -hmm. Mac. Mm -hmm. And um, before you you bought that laptop, okay, did you have a list of right. things before you bought it? 
did you list like the considerations on what the, is your choice in buying that laptop or what is your consideration in getting or buying a laptop i i care about a brand brand the brand what else it's just the brand um i like uh, adele adele Right. Me, I'm using HP. <laughs> All right. Yeah. And anyways, and what else? Aside from the brand, what else do you, um, um, what else do you consider when you buying those or when you bought that laptop? Just the brand? Only the brand? <laughs> I uh, I have uh, machine uh, comparison. <laughs> the the price. Uh, the configuration also. Yes, I am. Um, okay. Are you bought? Did you bought the brand new or the second hand? Uh, I uh, I like brand new. Brand new, yeah, same here. I like brand new, but no money. Okay, let's go to second hand. <laughs> 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 well, you see, when 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 teacher is poor, okay, let's not get the brand new. You have no money. <laughs> so that is correct. Now here, say what you bought and explain where you bought it and how you choose it and use them in past simple. Okay, now, you told me that you bought the laptop last month, right? Yes. All right, now here, I want you so that you will, it will be easy for you. I want you to write here. This one. Type in here so that I will read if you really got um, the the exact uh, form of the sentence. Okay. Now write what is being asked here. Read this one first. Say uh, say what you bought and is it... say bought. Uh, bought. All right. And uh, explain. Ex explain. Explain where you bought it and how you choose it. Use the past simple. All right. Can you do it? Okay, now try to type in. I'll give you five minutes to type in and I'll check your answer. <coughs> Oh, I mean, uh, talk about uh, laptop. Yeah, talk about the laptop. Use uh, the past simple, okay? Past simple tense. I, I buy I buy a laptop uh, at a uh, at a. Type here. Type here. Type here. 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 Ah, uh, right, right here, right here. Uh, yes, type in. Uh, I want to see and make use of the, I mean, construct the correct sentence, okay? Right. Make sure that you make the verb into past simple tense, okay? I 
You can do it, Peter. Go, 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 Peter. Peter Parker. You know, Peter, do you still remember what Uncle Ben told you? With great power comes a great responsibility. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Go on, answer. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Okay, let's try to check. I choose buy a laptop at a store last month. Alright, this one is wrong spelling. Okay. Month. Okay. Here. I chose past tense chose by past simple is I chose but uh, right but, uh, yeah. uh, I bought or this one only this one you can delete this one I bought a laptop at the store Last month. Okay. I looked or I checked here. I checked the 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 configuration. Then I looked and I looked mm, I looked the price so which was suitable for my ability to pay then then over here then then I then I will Decide and I will decide and I will decide to buy it. Mm. Right? So I bought a laptop at the store last month. I checked the configuration, then I looked the price which was suitable for my ability to pay then I will decide to buy it okay okay that is how you answer it okay yes all right so how, how was the experience 
in answering those type of um, um, and task. Did you find it hard? Is it hard? You think? I don't. I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> like um, I know English is very challenging, right? Especially when you uh, um, uh, um, sentence construction. When you say construction, it's um. Uh, it's not about you saying words, uh, breaking words. It's not like that. It's about how you say um, English words or English sentence in a correct form. Okay. This time over here, look this one. Many mistakes. Okay. Okay. So this one, this is how you answer it okay yes okay now next time i want you to be careful with how you are going to answer the task that is being given to you okay yeah all right are okay. you sleepy <laughs> yes, <maybe>. all right, <laughs> because the hours that you chose is very late already. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But anyways, I was, I am still very much, um, I am still very much, I'm happy that, um, I, uh, that I was able to get your slot or your schedule, okay, because I am very much, um, willing to teach you, okay, yeah, uh, but right now you're okay. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. Huh? Okay, Peter, Bye. it's of about time already. It's we have less than one minute. I hope you enjoyed our um, session today. Okay. Yeah. All right, and you know, enjoy the rest of the evening. I know you are sleepy, and yeah, good night. <laughs> good night. Right? Good night, Bye. Peter Parker. Like, like that, Peter Parker. Spider Man. <laughs> yeah, Spider Man. Spider. -Man. Always remember, with great power comes a great responsibility. Okay. Good night, Peter Parker. Bye. Good night, teacher. Bye. Bye. -bye. Good night.